Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome back. It feels like the first day of school all over again. But before we embark on this new learning um, experience for us all, I want you guys to understand a couple things. Up until today, your child has always been learning from school. They've had a desk, they've had a teacher, they've had classmates, they've had a lunch lady, they have, they've had a principal, they've had another teacher in the classroom. This is new to them. Now that they're home, there's so many distractions as you can obviously hear in my background. There's a TV, there's siblings, there's grandmas, grandpas, a whole bunch of other people are introduced to, into their learning experience. So I want you guys to understand, just give them some time, give them some patience. They will be easily distracted. Understand that, all right? Another thing I want you to know when it comes to home learning now, I want you to create a routine for them, a schedule, something that works for you at home and for your child as well. Because I know that some of you guys are still working from home. So you have to see um, what schedule works best. Do I, like, do I do we need to do this early in the morning or should we do this um, mid-afternoon? You have until 11.59 to complete all assignments. So there are all, all assignments are open from 7.30 a.m. to 11.59 p.m. You have all day. What works best for you at home? That's what I want you to follow. Um, if you see that they're working so much and they get a little like, you start seeing them get like tired of working, don't push them. It's okay. Take a brain break. Dance, sing, paint, color. Go to the backyard and practice social distance, safe social distancing and get some air, get some, breathe, and then let them come back in and start all over again. I want you guys to be the best. You teachers, I mean, you parents, sorry. I want you parents to be the best substitute teacher that you can be we go back to the days that when you were in school and your teacher was out for the day and your substitute teacher came in what were some of the things that you would like your teacher to your substitute teacher to do implement them like you cannot you could actually have pajama days you know okay all right um all right today we're going to go to school in our pajamas you can actually have silly silly outfits they do whatever it is that you want to do it's your learning experience as well it's, you, you know your home has become their second classroom so do as you choose in your classroom but make sure the assignments are done you have until 11:59 p.m of that day no if you miss the assignment it will not be available the next day you have to complete them all until 11:59. but still fit them into your schedule see what works best for you and have fun don't feel like you're bothering me if you're texting me on my phone, if you're texting me on Class Dojo, if you're calling me. Don't feel like, oh my God, no. Face, I want you to FaceTime me. I want you to Dojo me. I want you to Skype me. I want you to text me. I want to have that, that communication with you throughout this experience. Bye. Right, you got this.